Newly released video showing the moments a canine officer took down a suspect. Police believe they may have been a part of a multiple robberies going on around uh, Butler County. Yeah, Ken Brown is live in Middletown tonight with a video that you're only going to see right here on Fox 19 now. Yeah, that's right, guys. A Middletown police report says that they were already aware that a stolen vehicle had allegedly been involved in several robberies throughout the area. And a few weeks ago, Middletown police spotted that vehicle driving through city streets. This Middletown police officer is driving off the road for a good reason. He's setting up at the end of this street and getting ready to join a chase that's rolling down the roadway. Police are on the tail of a car connected to an attempted robbery at the Lemon Township Kroger just minutes earlier. Middletown police say Leonardo Alexander Cornwall is the 18 year old behind the wheel of the vehicle. A dispatch report from the Butler County Sheriff's Office says the driver walked into the Kroger, grabbed some items, jumped in line at the store, and handed the cashier a note that said, put all the money in the bag or I'll shoot you, I have a gun. In the distance, you can see the white sedan police are after drive over one median before crashing over a second. With his car out of commission, police say Cornwall took off running near Middletown High School. While several other officers get out of their car and attempt to chase down the suspect, the one we're watching behind the wheel decides to keep the motor running. And while police chase down Cornwall, it's the four-legged officer who gets the takedown of the teenager. That's canine officer Bear coming into the picture, and after a few attempts, Bear has Cornwall on the ground. The teen was treated for a dog bite after being arrested by police. Cornwall is currently being held at the Butler County Jail, and the Clerk of Courts website says that he's looking at a first-degree felony for aggravated robbery, a third-degree felony for fleeing and eluding, a third-degree felony for receiving stolen property, and a couple of misdemeanor charges related to this incident. So the vehicle that Cornwall was allegedly driving in all of this, uh, Middletown police say in their report that it's connected to multiple robberies in nearby jurisdictions. Cornwall's next court date still has not been set, but of course we'll continue to follow the story. Reporting in Middletown, Ken Brown, Fox 19 now. Thank you, Ken Brown.